Okay, so you want to play Raft in VR, and there is a mod for you for this. Uh, if you didn't know that already, you probably won't be here. Uh, so let's just get into this. I'm going to show you where you can go. Don't worry about the URLs. I will put them in the description below. Uh, first of all, as you can see, we're at the page for the Raft VR mod at raftmodding.com forward slash mods forward slash raft vr so on this page we just want to skip right on down to how to install first of all we're going to go to step one download and install mod uh, loader so we're going to click on that click on download launcher as you can see i have a folder already made for the raft mod i like doing that with all my mods down below, you're going to have the browser that you're using yell at you that it doesn't like it. Go ahead and, at least in the Chrome, press key. Okay, and then we're going to come back to the main page again for the Raft VR mod. And then they want you to launch the the uh, mod itself, or I should say the mod launcher. We are going to agree to that. I say yes for it to find it. Uh, I did not have Steam up and running, so it will launch Steam and it will go ahead and find it. Now it also looks for new versions of the Raft mod loader, which there is at this time. It is 6.2.13. All right, so we'll update the mod. As you can see, it's downloading, and it has downloaded. So now we will press play. Okay. Now it's going to go through this, and it's going to show us the mod itself. Okay. And then what we're going to do is just exit out of it after this does it. So... The mod should be shown up here momentarily after the screen. There you go. Okay. And what we're going to do is go like that and then exit out of that and say yes. Okay. Now what we want to do is go to our Steam library. Okay. We want to go over to Raft. You can right click on Raft or you can even right click here go to properties it does not matter uh, get to properties get to this area any way that you see fit and you're comfortable with unclick or uncheck use desktop game theater while stream steam vr is active okay you can just exit out of that minimize your steam session then after that we want to install the extra setting APIs, okay? And what you can do is go here. I like going right up to here, to here where it says versions and change logs, just to make sure that I'm getting the most up to date. I like using install mod instead of download. You can download it and then just click on it and it'll install. But installing mod just brings you right to the downloader and you just say yes, install it. It will install it all automatically. Okay. And then after that, just back arrow, back arrow. And then you can go to the Steam VR mod as well. So this is right here. It took me a few minutes to figure it out because there wasn't a link, but then I was like, oh okay here we go so then we'll do the same go version and change logs go install mod okay say install it okay very good then we're going to go back here and then we're going to press play on the mod loader so we'll bring the mod loader back up okay yeah, let's see, where are we? Play loader. This won't, this won't start the game in VR since it needs to apply some updates. So let's go ahead and press that. 
Okay, now with that coming up, let's bring that back up here. It's just going to do that. So what we're waiting for that to is do that, okay? And then in the mod menu, so the mod menu will come back up, okay? And then we will load the extra APIs and, and all that. And I'll show you how to do uh, 7 and 8. Let's see how that's doing. All right. Now this is the mod manager where you're going to activate everything you just installed. So click on mod manager. It looks like it activated the raft VR mod, but not the uh, extra setting API mods. So you want to come over here and click on the load mod area. So that's running now. Now that these are already clicked, you don't have to do this anymore. So you can just forget it. So you can go like that. So then now you can oh, go quit, right? And after that, uh, like it's saying, check the extra say, blah, blah, blah. You just check those boxes that were on the left-hand side. Close the mod menu. A dialog box should ask you Oculus, and no, it did not. So what we're going to do is bring it back up so we'll launch it at this time okay now it should ask us to if we want to use steam or oculus okay we will verify that the mod is working In error, why is that? Just down, okay. Okay, so it says 100, which if we can get back into the mod, let's get into the mod uh, thing here. Okay, exit, we'll exit out of raft. For some reason, I am not seeing. Okay, so let's go into the folder. See, those are there, so it should be working just fine. Maybe it automatically uh, selected Steam VR because Steam VR is launching. So let's go in and verify that is happening. So I'm going to get back, I'm going to get out of Steam VR. And then I'm going to start up my headset. And I'm thinking this is what actually happened, is that the uh, it's recognizing that I have Steam and not Oculus, so it's not asking me at all. What you're seeing right now is my wireless adapter for uh, my Vive. And it's being rude and interrupting us. So <laughs> let's do that. Okay, that's up and running now. We will bring this back up. And let's see if it uh, likes it or not. And this is just what you run across with uh, mods, things like that. It's not always 100%. Uh, when I installed this on sexy text computer it took me a couple rounds to get it to work so it's not a hundred percent is that going to stay up there is it going to disappear like it has in the past okay so it says it has a new version but it looks like i might be in the game yes i am as you can see I am in the game now. So what had happened is that it automatically uh, went ahead and and saw that it was I was uh, using Steam. I don't have Oculus on the on my computer like my wife uh, does because she has to using 
virtual desktop so it will see both and probably ask you at that point what you want to do so what you do from here to play the game is you just take one of your controllers and at this point just point up here and start having fun so there you go that is the install of raft vr mod thank you uh, please hit that subscribe please hit the like buttons and buttons <laughs> and this is chris saying out